Hey everybody, hope you're doing good today. I uh, wanted to uh, let you know what I woke up to, which was the Holy Spirit was definitely wanted me to say something about this situation that's been going on YouTube um, uh, regarding Brother Todd, which brings in a lot of other stuff too. Um, so what I want to do is, uh, first of all, straight up, I'm a little pissed off at what people have been saying and doing. And what they've been saying and doing has caused him to shut the entire channel down. And he's been on YouTube for about eight years, encouraging thousands of people, including myself, for five years. And, um, and they blame it all on, uh, uh, they blame it all on a, uh, what they've heard. Hearsay. Hearsay. That some of which is not even true and twisted, okay? And I've had people twist stuff uh, about me, uh, make lies about me, and um, it's very easy to twist stuff, and people believe it. And I'm really disappointed that so many people are believing whatever they hear, not even hearing both sides of the story. And um, it's absolutely... It's, it's absolutely unbelievable to me that somebody would be this scorned publicly, public, slandered publicly, who's done nothing but encourage people for eight years, supernatural encouragement hearing from the Lord. And uh, I'm really disappointed in what's going on out there. I do not agree with what people are doing. And if you think that your sin is better than his, then I really don't understand you. And apparently, I guess you do. And I want to remind you that Romans uh, 14 says that anything that, that is not of faith is sin. And that's a pretty big one. If you have no doubts all day long about anything, then I guess you're doing well and you're sinless. And congratulations. Because uh, either the blood of Jesus works or it, it does not. And um, if you want to compare the requirements of a bishop in 2 Timothy 3 to a guy talking about God in his car, uh, it's inappropriate. It's inappropriate. And on top of that, where are the facts? This, these accusations are based on one person's story without any proof or evidence. Uh, it's very easy to twist stuff. Very easy to give a slanted story when you don't have both sides and to make all of these rebukes against him based on somebody who has personally come against him publicly where it's not even appropriate for YouTube at all. Okay, that should be in a counselor's office. Uh, to even uh, respond to it with so much weight is inappropriate because the actual thing presented to YouTube was inappropriate. So, um, you know, I, I love you all. I love you all, even though I don't agree with what you've done. Um, it really, it really makes me mad what I see because I don't see truth and justice. I don't see it here. I pray that none of you are more concerned about, uh, I don't know, something, anything else besides the truth, the truth about everything and what God how God sees it, and, um, uh, you know, plenty of you might even be mad at me for saying this, I don't care, because the only thing I care about is what's right, what's true, and, and Jesus Christ, he said, I am the truth, I am the truth, and he hates lies, he hates injustice, he hates all of it, and uh, I've had it done to me, slander, I know what it feels like, there's nothing you can do about it when people believe lies. Absolutely nothing. And of course, they always mix in some truth and some mistakes to really get people drawn into it. And uh, so I, I, I'm going to say that um, on this one. I really don't care what anyone thinks about what I'm saying here uh, against me because the only thing I really care about is what's right before God and what lines up to his word and Jesus Christ who came to set us free, there is therefore no condemnation to those who are in Christ Jesus. 
That's exactly what he said, and that's exactly what he meant. And um, so I hope you're happy that you have now taken down one of the most amazing ministries on YouTube. Unique. Not many people can do that kind of thing. And, uh, and uh, I, I, uh, I just pray that, um, you know, I don't know what to say. I, I can't believe any of this. Um, like I said, I forgive you. I don't hate you. I still love you. But I had to say something because this is not right. And, uh, but you know, God will get the glory in the end for everything and he'll do the right thing in the end and he'll bring justice where justice is due. Everything will be fair in the kingdom of God. It will be, uh, it'll be awesome. So, uh, love you guys and I'll see you next time.